Okay, so uh, I'm gonna show you guys the setup at tent here. I'm gonna explain to you a bit what we did. So you guys already had your line over here. Let's keep it through. You put your line. So what we did, like from that post right here, right? So we we extend the line down lower. At the end of the day, you put those two poles back to where the other ones, the snow cat can work it. Those two banners are right here. They also come on that side, right? So the reason why we're doing this is for stopping people from ripping down this way on their way to school barn because there's people coming down the other way and it's a collision point. The collision point will be just about here. Okay, so that's what we do, that's what we do it this way. Now, the fence is now on the other side of the road. All right, right on the kicker. So even today when I was working on this, I had kids coming by. They want, they came here to hit the kicker. And they're like, we can't hit the kicker anymore because there's a fence over there now. So that's exactly why we put the fence over here. Now you can see the traffic coming in. You put the fan with the fencing with an opening right there. We're going to move this stuff down a bit once the rest of the run is groomed. So what you do is you put banners right in front of the opening to actually get the people to do exactly what these people are doing right now. They're going to come around the banner, then they go out the exit. So when you do the, the mountain safety over here, is you plonk yourself behind that banner right here and you redirect the traffic. You tell people not to stop in the entrance, to move down the way a little bit, right? Just like this gentleman right there. Sir, could you please just move down a bit down further? Thank you. Right, so you see how the traffic all goes around, then they hit, right? Nobody can hit the kickers because there's a rope there. So the rope's gonna be high enough so they can't jump it, and it's gonna be low enough so they can't go underneath it. So this whole rope fencing over here will be all wrapped up and put at this end at the end of the day. At that end over there. These two banners behind me here, also they get wrapped up and they get put at that end with this rope fencing. This rope fencing on the other side gets put up with the other banners and the other rope at the end there. All right, so this is it for 1010. See how the traffic all comes down the same way now? They all have to go through the exit. It's all nice and smooth. Last week it was so chaotic, it was like crazy. Right? So, there you go. This is how it's done.